Good morning guys, welcome back to the next video. So I'm here in Bali, Kintamani region, where there's a lot of beautiful mountains, just like that, and surrounded by volcanoes. And yeah, I've been here for like four days already. So today, I thought, you know, I would just go down to Ubud, make a day trip, just explore Ubud in general. Yeah. So just done with my breakfast. Just gonna chill here until the afternoon and gonna meet a bunch of my friends my friends in Ubud for lunch and then from there on we'll just go around at Ubud and then at night we'll be back here again so yesterday I visited one of the cemetery in one of the small villages right across the lake and yeah I, I couldn't sleep last night after after witnessing experiencing like what I have like after like uh, seeing all those things it's just it's just new to me and the, you know the scene that I, I saw yesterday it keep repeating in my eyes like it keep repeating in my mind I can see exactly like the the person the body the way the environment I remember the tree vividly everything was just in my mind and I just couldn't sleep last night like oh, it's quite crazy yeah I was supposed to woke up or wake up for like morning sunrise but I, I just didn't because I didn't sleep last night so yeah that was kind of like a shocking for me yeah, so when it comes to those things I'm, I'm a little bit scared so yeah it was it was a good experience I would say I've never seen anything anything done like that before I've, I mean I have a few of my you know my grandparents pass away and the way we do it is so different from the way they do it and I was saying that you know different locals are saying different things because one of the guy one of the owner of my the, the last villa he, he was saying that oh, they burned the body after five years and yesterday there was there was another guy at at the village he wasn't really a guy he was just a guy who was just hanging around hanging out by the by the pot by the <coughs> yeah and then he would just he just follow us along and he started speaking he didn't ask for any money or anything he just he just wanted to share with us and he was saying that you know they don't really burn it they wait until everything is decomposed and then their village head they will come and perform some ceremony then they will take the, the skull and they'll line it up on top of the yeah with a, a bunch of other skulls so yeah that's pretty interesting but I'm not sure which side of the story is true I'm just a, just a tourist who want to see things so yeah just want to apologize if I'm putting out like wrong information on the internet but just to let you guys know I'm just repeating what the locals have said to me so yeah anyways it's very very interesting how you know things are here
I'm at this cafe called Olympus Cafe Bali. And this whole stretch, right, is just full of cafe like this with a view like this. So yeah, there's like more than 20 cafes. You can you can take your pick and yeah, go for a, go for a coffee, chill with the view. It's pretty hot outside. We were sitting outside just now. Apparently this place, I mean this cafe doesn't really have like shelter like the other side. Where they yeah. So we just we decided to move inside but this the view is still fantastic. That is Mount Batuk. And we are probably staying behind the mountain where there's the that lake over there. So we have changed like seats for three times. <laughs> I think this is our spot. This is our spot. Just can't get enough. So we ended up spending the entire day here and now we can't even see anything. It's just white. Yeah. Still waiting for my friends. It's so cold. 
that I feel like I just took an ice bath. Whew. Time to get back in. We thought, you know, we could come out, walk around, explore a little bit. But no, it's too cold. Whew. Came by to the cafe next door. Looks pretty cold. And it's pretty cold up here. So Suddenly, there's like a. Oh, I'll show you, I'll show you. See that big clouds running through? Yeah. It's also running through this way. That's <coughs> why it's so cold. Ooh. And when the cloud is gone, the temperature changes uh, in a minute or two, like become warm again. Because it's still, it's not early, but it's still like, you know, 5 p.m. So, yeah. Hopefully, not a lot of those clouds came by because I'm already freezing. So I club jai border talo no. Sorry. Five hours, five bloody hell. <laughs>